it's me, Starfy. And Benji. And we are here today to play Super Mario 3D World. Meow. Um, I'm here to play and Ben's here for the commentary. Yes. I'll be offering, I won't call it valuable insight, but <laughs> I'll be offering words, if nothing else. Pearls of wisdom when I forget things, or yeah. And I will play Luigi, but I will probably be randomising this, because I quite like doing that. Um, Adds a bit of variety, doesn't it, yeah. rather than playing as the same character for every single level. Not that there's anything wrong with playing as the same character for every single level, but I'm sure like later in the game there are certain switches and things that you can only press as specific characters. Yeah. So it does semi-encourage you to play as other characters. Plumbing. Also plumbing for the win. <laughs> it's not very often that you see Mario and Luigi do plumbing. Yeah, they're like ironically the considering main job. It's considering it's their actual profession. Did you know they were supposed to be carpenters before they were actually plumbers? Why did they change it? What's... I don't know. I'm not sure. I was going to say what's the difference. I know what the difference between a carpenter and a plumber is. But I'm why... glad. <laughs> but why was it more... Why is it significant? ...more desirable to have them as plumbers rather than carpenters? <sighs> no! good to see that Bowser's you know, stretching out and not always taking the same person. No. Sometimes he takes fairies too. He's not a one trick pony or Koopa. Well, at least it was Mario that got it. Four go in, one comes out. So this is the world map, and I really like what they do with the world map on these. Particularly this one, because you can kind of just run around like so. Yes, indeed. Oh, I collect the odd coin here and there. Yeah. Let's jump straight into world one, level one. Super Bell Hill. I always start in this territory. Well, you are in the first world, but the first world tends to be green. Yeah, it's only one to you vandal! <laughs> Terrible. Toad is setting an awful example. So I guess the cat suit is kind of like the go-to gimmick for this game, isn't it? Because in 3D Land they brought back the Tanuki suit, which is like the main gimmick in that one. And then for this one they introduced the cat suit. I think a lot of it is set up for it because there's a lot of walls you need to climb yeah. and things you need to do specifically as a cat. Well, like I say, it's the main go-to gimmick that they use in this one, so they wanted to get as much mileage out of it as possible. Oops. There are spins. Mm, you can move But can you just stare at spin up there? Ow! That was not friendly. They were just waiting there to ambush you. I was succeeded. I was kind of wondering why you didn't just use the bell that was in your supply. I guess because it was going to be easy to get I love the music when you're underwater, goes like muffled. Well, have you ever tried listening to music underwater? It's not easy. I mean, not that I can say I have, but. Me either. When Electricity I'm in the and bath, water does not mix. When I'm in the bath and there's something playing. Yeah. 
my god. Giant toad! See, for some reason, when we went past that warp pipe, I thought it just took you up to the top. Yeah, me too. <sighs> okay. Take it back. <laughs> Indoor plumbing. I do feel like we are putting so many Disney references. <laughs> No, that's just the way of getting up there if you didn't still have the cat suit. There are plenty of coins in this game. Mew. Is that his favourite Pokemon, do you think? Could be. You got a cat Mario stamp. Woo! And you weren't even playing as Mario. No, I was playing as Cat Toad and then Giant Toad. But you also completely finished the first level. I did. Go me! Nice gooey. Plenty of random coins, and just to keep up with tradition, level two is a underground level and I forgot to find the lines. Guess we're playing as Toad again, peeps. Ah! I'm going before this <laughs> Well, I was going to say, what you've got to ask yourself is, is it actually going to be worth it in the long run to defeat this coup? No. Mm -hmm. That's the way you're supposed to do that. Yeah. You just get it in an angle so it can rebound. When he has the fire flower, Toad actually looks like one of those giant mushrooms. Not the giant. Could he say that? I would not eat a mushroom if it was that bad. Yeah. Generally, you'd think it would be dangerous. <laughs> yeah, I would also not eat a mushroom that is the colour of this Toad normally. They tend to be poisonous, don't they? If they're blue colourful. Ones. Oh, I was thinking the red one. Oh, I love how he's wearing underwear. No, well, I mean, you just took his shell off. So it wouldn't be decent if you did. I think you missed out on the green this time. Oh. oh no, you haven't. No, it's okay. The first one's okay. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's how you're supposed to do that as well. Oh, what are you doing? <laughs> Who jumps into fire? Me, apparently. Voluntarily. <laughs> Quick, get the star and dodge the shadows. <laughs> you may want to use it. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> throw the fire. Throw the fireballs through the pipes. Goomba had like a turbo. Did you see how quickly it was yeah. moving? It was like, ooh. 
on a mission. Go back a second. Why? Because there's an upward path up there. If you switch to your bell, you might be able to go up there. No, 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 not there. Further along in the next level. Not there. Well, I don't know how I'd get up there. Like that. Oh. Oh. Is this just one of those cheating things where I you skip the whole level? That. Yeah. Because <laughs> there's normally one of those in the underground levels, isn't there? I think it's the here. <laughs> Down! No! Well, only because I'm struggling to actually get through the pipe anyway. Gold pipe. Oh. So it wasn't you a missed, cheaty thing. You missed out on nothing. Nope. Stop it. <laughs> Taking a short detour. Ow! <laughs> <clears throat> Oops. Not Supposed to be avoiding injury, but you know. <laughs> you didn't even try <laughs> for the ten thousand on that one. I always find that. I always find I lose momentum in the last bit. Move a coin. Always go for that one coin. Will I ever learn? It's just a coin. Choose a box to open. Will you go for the big gift or the small gift? I like how I'm looking up at them like, ooh. <laughs> oh, it's a mushroom. I wonder if Toad likes eating mushrooms, because I mean, he kind of resembles one. <laughs> It's like eating his ancestors. Ooh. Or his descendants. Are we just chilling like a villain? Charge and chuck. I remember to randomize and we got Mario. Oh, God. <laughs> it's barely a level. Plus, I believe they come back. Eight bit running Mario. I mean, yeah, Mario. I do mean Mario. Yes, you do. Time for Mount Beanpole. <clears throat> Who's it gonna be? It's Peach. Oh, I love her hair. She's got it all tied back. Well, she's slinging fireballs. Yeah, that would be kind of 
painful. You don't want to set your hair on fire. You don't generally want to set your anything on fire. Right. That's a good thing to avoid. Ah! This is an interesting level because it's like up rather than across, if that makes sense. It's taller than it is wide. Yeah. <laughs> Nom nom. All these enemies are so cute. But I'm almost like, oh yeah, they're also deadly. <laughs> Lets you climb up literally any Anything, surface, yeah. whether it's like <laughs> you know, whether it's like earth or tree or oh, brick. I feel like the cats do that in real life, like they do climb up just about anything. Yeah, but most of the time they just like spring <laughs> to the top. Yeah. Especially if it's a tree and they're like, oh god, I can't get down. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> Forward planning is not their strong suit. Hey, I could say the same thing about these Goombas. That were, conveni <laughs> that were conveniently <laughs> provided for you. Well, there's more than one way to uh, yeah, pop cat off cat. a cat boomba. Go back. <laughs> Yeah, normally in these games they have like a, a certain surface that you can climb on, which is like a mesh or something. Yeah, that's true. Oh, it's cloud time. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> you nearly messed that up. That way harder than it needed to be. <laughs> yeah. To create competition where there is none. Well, Cat Goomba. When you play this on like two or more players, you do get a crown for the amount of coins you have. So if you've collected more points, you get a little crown in game. Uh -huh. Well, there you go. And now we know. Yep. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and like down below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more playthrough goodness. And I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.